Um, by about the 1850s, though, it had reached its peak. And by the 1913, with the 1913 flood, it was you know pretty much so done. But it lingered from 1913 to the 1960s. And then um, they had the dream and vision to save the canal. So from the 1960s really to 2008, it's been an ongoing resource conservation project. The whole goal is to make the project relevant to everyday individuals' lives and also really point out the economic development impact. In some small way, we are trying to recreate the impact of economic development that the Ohio Neary Canal had. Uh, instead of maybe canal boats, you have hikers and bikers or canoeists and kayakers. Instead of canal warehouses, you have bed and breakfasts. That's, I think, one of the beauties of this project is that there's something in it for everybody.